good evening everyone myself is nitin r i'll be today demonstrating about interactive education animation on akash tablet how to create interactive education animation uh, i working in project oscar currently project oscar stands for open source uh, course web animation repository the official website is oscar.iitb.ac.in it's headed by professor shida iyer sir Currently, Project Oscar is a has a 350 interactive 2D and 3D animation. It's a online web-based interactive animation repository. It is a school level school level PG and uh, UG level animation like chemistry, physics, and biology, and mechanical and computer science animations. For the 3D animations, we use Blender. Blender is a 3D animation tool. We use Blender. Uh, you can download Blender from www.blender.org website. Why we use Blender? Like there are many 3D application, uh, 3D animation tools available as 3DX Max, Maya, uh, Maya, and all. But why the Blender it's itself is important? because blender is a 3d animation and modeling tool it has a own physics library and a 3d game engine it's a complete tool set complete package for this we required the most important part is free and open source for open source we can download the source files and we can create and add or uh, delete the features which you don't like and it's also compatible with windows linux and mac operating systems so the process is how to create a simulation like in uh, how to create a simulation or animation which can run on android or in the akash tablet so the first step is to create a 3d model of it the concept or the experiment which you want to animate or which you want to create a simulation of it first you have to create the 3d modeling of it the currently the demonstration which i am showing it's a eight standard school level experiment called single replacement reaction so you can see it as a table it has a beaker a clamp stand this is entirely the part is modeled in 3d inside blender the first we have to create the actual model of it and uh, we have to apply material the next step should be to apply material and lighting So why do we have to apply material and lighting to give the natural look of the environment? We have to create one laboratory kind of environment, the table, the glass, the beaker texture, and the material texture for the clamp. The next part is to add interactivity. So how do we add interactivity? If we have a one video file, we can have a interactivity like a play and pause interactivity. but if i want for interactive simulation there are more types of interactive can be added like mouse over touch a drag and drop or the we can have a keyboard interactivity so this kind of interactivity can be added by logic bricks python script and by animations so the logic brick is like we can see uh, the what kind of input you want to give if i want to give a mouse input or a keyboard input so each time if i apply a mouse or a keyboard input which kind of interactivity should be happening it defines by the logic bricks and then the more the advanced level of interactivity can be added by the python script python blender uses python as a scripting language for the more advanced and animations and uh, in the game engine in the interactivity blender itself is coded inside the python and can be used as a the script can be used inside uh, blender once if i have created the simulation or the animation inside blender how do i transfer the files inside on the akash tablet because there is no working environment for blender available for android platform for android os operating system we don't have a working blender we have a blender for windows mac or linux uh, operating system available but we don't have on android platform for the blender community for that purpose have created a blender player so it's a application file can be downloaded from download.blender.org/ftp/incoming once you have downloaded application file can be installed on akash tablet the next part 
is to have a dot blend file what we have created the animation on the desktop transfer that file to akash tablet like we have the doc, dot doc doc extent or dot txt extent for the text file or the documentation file the blender is it dot blend as the extension files so once we have this file we can open this dot blend file into the akash tablet and browse the file and can play the file i'll be showing the demonstration currently we have this blender file this dot uh, blender file uh, available for the single replacement reaction as you can see i have cre uh, this is entire setup of the animation is created there is a table there is a beaker and there is a clamp stand the material and the material in the texture is applied the lighting part is done for the same animation it is transfer into the blender file so if we see the animation part of it like a video file so this is how the animation part looks if i have a directly render output as a avi file video file but with this video file i cannot interact with the video file i can just play and pause the file if i want to increase the height of the clamp if i want to decrease if i want to slow the animation i cannot slow the animation the process is once start and a stop so i'll demonstrate how to do that on the tablet we have prepared the file okay i uh, i have installed the blender player on my akash tablet you can click and start so first it will ask for a blend file it has a select the game so if i click on it it will ask me to browse the file file i'll go to a file manager i have a single replacement file dot blend as a extension on my tablet and i'll start the blend player the user interface which it shows it is entirely created in blender so if i click on next okay it asks for a user interface a start for the simulation concept and a help if i click on concept it will show the what are the concept behind the animation or the simulation is back the help part will show how to play the how to play the animation and the reference link behind it and if i start the simulation so the what i can see on the desktop can be viewed on the tablet as well so with this four button i can have a mouse in uh, camera interactive i can zoom it around and can view from all 360 degree direction so if i touch on the clamp so this way we can view from all 360 direction and can we view from top view side view if i'll touch it again it will go up now we can see the reaction happening and there is a color change so this is the what one prototype which we have created so far the entire file the entire work is done in blender and can the whatever mouse interactivity is on the blender the keyboard interactivity is not yet working but the mouse interactivity what we can see can be transfer on the desktop on the tablet as a touch interactivity the prototype has been helped uh, created by sneha devrukar arun nair and pooja bhawar they are the part of the blender team at iit bombay Thank you.